Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make an epic progressive house track combined with future house. I came up with this idea when I heard the collaboration between Mike Williams and Nicky Romero. Epic. So let's get started. First we will start with the melody. What makes this melody so unique it's the rhythm. And that's because they use triplets. Instead of keeping the grid online you will need to select the 1 stroke 3 option. Now I will create a simple progressive house beat. Now we can start to add some sounds. For the lids I combined presets from my future house and progressive house sample pack. And I will add two mono layers. And for the processing I used a lot of EQ to remove the bad frequencies and to boost some of the highs. And now we will move on into the chords. For the chords I used 5 presets, make sure to cut the low end, otherwise you will get a muddy mix. Then you will need to add a simple piano. The final element of the drop is the bass line. Always make sure that you cut the high frequencies of the bass to leave room for the lids. So now that we finish the drop I will show you how to create the breakdown and the build up. For the breakdown I kept the same chord progression but I changed the preset. On the second bar I introduced some Martin Garrix chords to make the breakdown more interesting. And for the drums I used some simple claps with a lot of reverb. On the next bar they introduced the main melody but without any side chain. This is a great way to make the listeners get used to the melody. For 
for the build up I used the main leds but I added a fruity filter, then I added some risers, some claps and a build up snare. And the final step it's to add the vocals which I got from Fiverr. Let's see how the final result sounds like, but before make sure to subscribe. subscribe.